the future is looking not so sweet for honeybees. Well, I think it's tragic. I mean, they pollinate our food. The latest buzz, the bee population is in serious trouble. Well, here we go again, basically. You know, I got another year of loss and, and we just have to keep rebuilding back and splitting our colonies. Beekeeper Bob Finch sees the problem firsthand. You hate to see the devastation loss. I mean, you have to be able to put up with loss and grief of thousands of your livestock thousands and thousands of bees. Here at Berkshire Hills Honey Bee Farm, there's hundreds of bee colonies, but each year they're faced with significant loss, which can be difficult to restock. This year, the decline in the bee population is even more alarming. 40.7% this past year nationally, which is the highest loss since 2006. At Berkshire Hills, Finch's loss is even worse. We lost 50%, which is not good at all. Past years, I've lost up to 75% of my colonies. He relies on honeybee colony reports to help his bees, but new budget cuts by the Trump administration are pushing the USDA to suspend data collection. For the government to pull funding for bee research uh, touches me um, pretty deeply. It means losses to his colonies could remain a mystery. There's a lot of unknown too, and that's that's why the research is so important. And to and to have that gone, or or pulled, um, is very concerning.